See you in the morning. I love you too. What? I love you too, honey. I'll see you in the morning. I love you too. Hello, my classics. You might be wondering why on earth I'm wearing a wig that makes me look like Morticia. Well, that would be because I got a request to do a look and I'm kind of glad I got a request. Actually, I'm extremely glad I got a request because I was totally stumped on what to do today. So the request is here and it is a very goth look but it's a smoky eye i've never done this extreme of a smoky eye before we're just gonna jump on in this thing and get her going i love you too see you in the morning how can you ever see me in the morning if you don't go to sleep see you in the morning it is literally 9.30 when I'm doing this. I'm just doing all my normal steps. Here I have my Burt's Bees. I probably should have put the wig on last, but who the heck cares? I think I'm gonna try something new with it. <laughs> now I look almost as pale as the picture. Okay, powder, 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 powder. Where did that powder go? Oh, here it is. All right, I'm gonna try. I'm trying my best to make myself as pale and tragic as I can get. It looks like she's got a very matte look. I've got my reference picture right down here. Always use a reference picture when you're mimicking a look. I learned that the hard way because you can't always get it all by memory. Got my airbrush. I'm just setting my face. Gonna get rid of all the shine that I can. Because like I just said, it looks like she's got a very matte look going. Next, I'm going to prime my eyes. Just going to quickly grab a brush, and a small brush, and a, this is my Tinted Eye Primer in Peach Glow from Ulta I had bought enough of an Ulta product that I got a packet of things for free. Always handy. Ah! This looks like it's the kind of makeup job that's very precise, so I'm trying to be that. Just taking a little teeny tiny bit on this teeny tiny brush. I'm working along with her of my eyeball. Let's see. Eyebrows. I'm actually, I've grabbed this since my hair is black now. I've got the Revlon, the Color Stay Eyebrow Kit. Because I bought it in a soft black and the only complaint I had of it was that it was, that I had made a mistake and not purchased it in the right color. She's got a bigger brow though, so I'm going to try to fill this in a little bit more. Okay, so there's the brows. I hope I did that well. I think I did. It's okay. I've done worse. And now her eyeshadow looks like it's pretty much one color, matte black. But it's hard to tell because her eyes are open. She doesn't have a shot while her eyes are closed. So uh, we're just going to grab the the only color I the only where place I have black is in my color burst, ironically enough. So I'm going to be using that. I'm gonna prop it on my lap though. So.
All right, mine turned out a little bit more oval than hers did, but that's okay. I'm going to grab another brush, a thinner brush, thin black one, and I'm going to start smoking out that lower lash line. I'm gonna try to blend it right in with what I was doing. Then I'm going to take a whole bunch of white Smells so good, tastes so bad. Now she had a liquid white liner. I don't. But that's okay. I do intend to tr get a couple of those and try them. Just uh, haven't yet. Okay. Looks I think as good as that's gonna get. Which is okay because I think it looks kind of cool. I look very doughy eyed. Now I'm going to. Everything's laid out in front of me. She does have a winged liner. We do have a winged liner, people. Oh, that actually shows up in the viewfinder against the black really well. <laughs> in, in reality, it doesn't show up that well. Honestly, ever since I figured out how to do this, it's like my favorite thing to do. And by viewfinder, I mean computer screen, because I'm using my webcam right now. Because my battery needed to charge. She doesn't have any blush or bronzer or anything like that on. She just has the red lip and falsies. So, bet you thought I'd go with the smaller ones, but you'd be wrong. Dipstick. In case you're wondering, I'm wearing my tight man eater ones. They are heavy. I'm having a hard time keeping my eyes open actually. And not because I'm tired. Because I'm really not. I could probably go for a couple more hours. I love this. I would like to let everyone know that it is a I'm gonna try to recreate her uh, pose real quick. Hang on. All I really do look like is Morticia Adams. I'm sorry. I just, I, I, I tried to do this makeup look and I wound up looking like Tish, but I kind of don't like it. Anyway, let's help me. Ow. Well, seriously, that's heavy. It's like 26 inches. I really do need to trim it up. So what do you think? I think that it's kind of cute. Uh, it's a little darker than I normally would go this decade. <laughs> Last decade, you had me right where I belong. Those are going to be fun taking off. What I'm really looking forward to is tomorrow I'm going to look like a, a panda bear because I'm out of makeup wipes. So I'm going to have to just wash my face to get this off. Thanks, Devin. <laughs> this is gonna be exciting. Just trying to smooth my hair back because it under the wig, you know, had her. If you have any makeup suggestions you want to see, drop a comment down below or you know whatnot, and let me know because I will pretty much do them if I. I have the stuff to do so so yeah if you like this video please be sure to give it a big thumbs up if you haven't yet hit that subscribe button down below and make that bell ring loud and proud so you know when I'm posting because I post every Monday Wednesday and Friday at 12 central time that's noon not midnight if I get a thousand subscribers by Christmas Day, I'll do one of three things and I'll let you pick what one. Bye, see you, love you, always thinking of you. Have a really great day. Don't let anyone get you down. Don't let anyone do your sparkle. And remember, do it with passion or not at all. I'm going in the hole. I'll never stop. Hey, Mom.